हेलो एवरी वन आई एम डॉक्टर विनय कुमार ऑर्थोपेडिक सर्जन एट श्रीकर हॉस्पिटल्स आई एम यूर मेनली टू डिस्कस अबाउट द शोल्डर इंस्टेबिलिटी शोल्डर जॉइंट इज अ बॉल एंड सॉकेट टाइप ऑफ जॉइंट इन बिच अ बॉल लाइक ह्यूमरस आर्टिकुलेट्स अगेंस्ट द कप लाइक ग्लीन ऑयट एंड इट गिवस अ गुड रेंज ऑफ मोशन इन अ नॉर्मल इंडिविजुअल वेन अ पर्सन सफर्स फ्रॉम अ ट्रामा और एनी अदर डिजेंडेशन प्रॉब्लम the covering of the shoulder joint the capsule the labrum which you call you can see the humerus when it articulates against the glenoid this labrum holds the ball in place and this will give good stability to the shoulder joint and you have the cuff muscles on the shoulder so when because of trauma it usually happens in athletes or high velocity injuries where the ball the humerus comes out of the socket and gets displaced this is called usually in a layman's term it's called a shoulder dislocation so when a shoulder dislocates for the first time the labrum is torn and it becomes lax and because of recurrent episodes normally most of the times what happens is the joint which is dislocated is reduced back and most of the people feel okay for some time over a period of time this laxity increases and they might feel that instability and weak pain and the ball easily dislocates for the second time because of this laxity in the labrum so this shoulder instability is mainly because of the torn labrum so when you uh, when you experience such kind of shoulder instability or dislocation and you have a very you know n number of episodes of shoulder dislocation please do consult a doctor and get evaluated when you consult a doctor we usually do is we check clinically the instability there are few tests we do then we go for imaging in which we do the x rays ct scans and still detailed examinations can be done by mri mri gives a good soft tissue details about the labrum soft tissue structures bones and everything if there is defect in the bone we might also do the 3d ct scan and once your problem is detected we will suggest you about the surgery and the surgery for recurrent dislocation nowadays is with very 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 uh, minimal invasive procedure which is called as arthroscopic <coughs> bank arch repair this labrum which is torn of the glenoid is repaired back to its to its place with minimally approach that is with arthroscopic technique 